Hi guys, and welcome back to another episode. Now, after my very long last episode, um, 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 I'm going to be actually finishing um, the uh, season. Uh, I feel like, actually, the highest we can finish is in a Champions League spot, maybe in third if we're lucky. Yeah, we could actually finish in third. Arsenal <laughs> doing really good for Arsenal. Sadly, West Brom can't break Derby's record. <laughs> but they're definitely relegated 16 points off um, Southampton. Southampton have a game less than them. And, oh, wait, actually Leeds may survive. Where are Fulham 10th? I'm just looking at the clubs that have recently been re so promoted. Mm, I like seeing Wolves doing good, but I will be playing. Um, I won't be playing the West Ham game. I'll be playing the Liverpool and Everton game. <laughs> you know, why don't why don't we just like why don't all the players just have a holiday in in like. Uh, Liverpool, and they and they just travelled to Leeds for that one game. But okay, so two games on Saturday, and the final game of the season is a Sunday game. But I will uh, sim the game against West Ham, and I'll play the game against Liverpool. Hi guys, I have just completed the Liverpool game. And it was a good game actually. Um, Wilson scoring this. Okay, we have actually scored a goal that a nine year old could score. But then this goal, it was actually decent play from St. Maximin to, to get it into Wilson, who literally. Yep, it is Pietro Pellegrini. Like, I. Because early on, uh, Roberto Firmino got injured and Pietro Pellegri, uh, was subbed on, and I was like. Pellegri? He's. You're not gonna score any goals. Like, imagine having Pietro Pellegri up front. Bleh. <laughs> like, no, for Liverpool. Oh, Jota playing on the wing. Okay, I'm happy about that because I'm a Wolves. <laughs> but yeah, like uh, their defence, their centre backs are Alexander Arnold, Kabak, and Sewell. I'll be buying Kabak next season, hopefully. But yeah, Marnie. So not Marnie. Uh, but goals. Oops. Alison literally made one save and Dubravka made two, so. The thing that might put us up into fifth or sixth, because the race for European football is like a really big one. Right now, I think eighth has a chance at getting third. Like, over these last couple games, anything could happen. He kept a good team display. But no, I'm not obsessed with the run, to be honest. Amazing. You must be with the lads. I think the lads. Yeah. Okay, a win! Yeah, some reason, look, I actually, I can't, uh, yeah, I, I said that halfway through the season, but Bessa, um, will be kept at the club, because, obviously, Wilson's still getting goals in, but, yeah, Bessa, with eight assists this season, uh, when Wilson stopped scoring, Bessa stopped assisting, 
because like he's really good at playing through balls uh, through into uh, Wilson but Wilson scored so many goals in the first half of the season that uh, that it was quite hard to take his title of being top goal scorer and yeah um, I'll come back once I've finished the Everton game just won this game um i'll need to see how uh how wolves did in their final game because if th they lost i know we're into uh i know we're into sixth and if they i think it's if they draw we might be into sixth depending on goal difference but we've drew way too many and like only won one nil way too many times to do that good in goal difference. I think the only game where we had that was actually two goal difference. No, there was two. But, um, mm, the team. I want done. <laughs> Every player did his job. We gave ourselves some time on to. We've beaten Everton twice this season. Have we? I th I'm sure that we... Uh, oh. Now it depends on uh, what's happening. Because if... Whoever wins the Carabao... Okay, where did Spurs finish? But the final will be... Spurs against United. Yes! If either Spurs or United win that. Yep, so we're through to Europa League. Sadly and better, who I actually had plans to sign next season, is out injured. Lascelles is back from his injury, I didn't know. Oh, he's just bruised his shoulder. I will be properly buying him next season. I liked him. Now I can go over our top performers this season. Callum Wilson, 24 goals and 7 assists. Oops. <laughs> So, and then St. Maximin with a total of 19 goal contributions. Um, Hayden with four um, goals and six assists. For Bessa, four goals and eight assists. Jean Pedro, four goals. Now, well, two goals for us. And Taylor Roberts. This, uh, this man actually feels like he's... Oh yeah, I was just going to say, this man feels like he's really tall. That's, that's where, uh, I, that's where I think he's really tall. He is six foot six. Like in real life, he'll still be growing. Like he'll only grow one or two more inches, but that's massive. Not sure, hey gaffer. I will actually be uh, properly buying him, like I said quite a few times. So, I will actually just... I don't think there's really much I want to sort out. So I think I can just go straight to the 29th. And... Yeah. So I will send to the 29th now. And... Um, I will... Uh, see who's I'll, I'll go and see who's won all the competitions and I'll go with them and show you as well so we end off the season with uh, Callum Wilson uh, getting the golden boot oh. 
Ah. Okay, no, I, I want to know, like, it should have been, um, but I was just wondering if the game thinks that they want to be mean to me and give it to Rashford instead, but it should be Wilson. Now, I, yeah, it was Real Madrid, uh, who won, uh, the Champions League. It was, who was it who, wasn't it Hoffenheim? Yeah, Hoffenheim, uh, and it was Spurs who won both the Carabao Cup and the FA Cup, which means that we're through, uh, into, I think we're into the Europa League, whatever it is, where you have to play against other teams that you get in seventh. Actually, last year, what clubs... On, on the Carabao Cup and um, the FA Cup. So, I think next year I hope to come in 6th, maybe 5th, because I don't want to do good and then start dropping, I don't want to do good then start getting better. Like, would it technically be possible in like FIFA or Football Manager? I think it would be more possible uh, in Football Manager, because it's got more uh, games, well, sorry, not um, years. So what you do is you, if you, is you get a club and each year you purposely, you like get one, two, you know, maybe three spots less than you did the year before. So you could win the league, maybe get second, then maybe get third or fourth, then start dropping off um, until, until you get relegated. I think that, that would technically be possible actually. So, um, please, please, can I sign better? Please, please, oh, no, I don't think I can. Please, oh, yes! I don't know why I'm so happy because I can sign this 73 rated player. I need to, I think I still have these players values, no I don't. I'm going to do trial, I won't be a great signing anymore. But Bessa could be an official signing at Newcastle. Maybe, maybe not. It depends what he says, <laughs> really. This is what the squad looks like. For season two, I'll probably be making a signing. Um, I'm just thinking. The main position that I've been thinking of is a new uh, backup uh, winger. Okay. Uh, yeah, I am actually trying to get the squad depth down because. Of course, uh, having a huge uh, squad depth means that a lot of players get really mad. For some reason, Sean Longstaff is still loaned out. Shouldn't the players... Yep, Almiron... It's actually gone up a rating uh, since he returned from his long-term injury, but then didn't get game time. Oh, there are the cells is. 
He'll probably be another one of those players which after their long term injury will just loan them out because it really affects how they've been playing and stuff. Well actually how much money are we given this year? Our first game of preseason is against Watford though. No wait, can I finish the deal? Oh, three players departing. Okay, what's my transfer budget? Please, please, please be decent. I, I, I yes, okay, but Besser? Yeah, I don't think I'm actually going to do any signings here, so, bye guys, hope you enjoyed today's video, I enjoyed making it, hope you enjoyed watching it, so bye!